Hey guys, it's me. Um, I'm doing an unboxing today. I got my order from Paint and Paper Studio. Uh, Zandra here on, uh, on YouTube runs Paint and Paper Studio, uh, Scraps to Beauty by Zandra. And I just got my order today, and uh, I thought I'd do an unboxing and share with what I, the goodies I got. Um, and if you're not an unboxing fan or uh, a haul share person, this video is not for you. <laughs> Look at the beautiful paper she sent me. OMG. I think that feels like, yeah, it feels like either, oh no, it's not, I don't think it's wallpaper, but it looks like wrapping paper and it kind of feels like wrapping paper. I'm pretty sure it's wrapping paper. Thank you, Z. I love it already. <laughs> the girl knows me. I am a, a butterfly fan for sure. I'm sorry if I jiggled the camera. Uh, so I'm going to undo that. And she always, um, uh, the link to her store um, is in the uh, sh uh, my favorite links and shops around the corner list. You'll find that in the description box of the video. Um, but uh, here's the name of her shop, Paint and Paper Studio. Um, she is a lovely, wonderful, sweet, sweet person. She is one of the sweetest per persons you'll ever deal with, and she just is just good great customer service and she always gives you little freebies look napkins cheers witches <laughs> I love that one <laughs> thanks Z awesome you guys she knows my affinity for I love working with napkins and tissue paper and wrapping paper any kind of thin paper I'm definitely a thin paper girl so um, but I love that cheers witches I love that napkin it's so awesome Okay, that's just filler. Oh, I got my order. Uh, in my order, she had got a kit from uh, 49 and Market. So I'm going to make this video, Paint and Paper Studio slash 49 and Market, because she got the kit, and it was at a really good price, so I, I couldn't resist. I had to get it from her. And this goes with uh, their, one of their newest lines that they re released, and... Um, yeah, I don't know what was all included in the kit, but I'm excited. <laughs> so these are rub-ons, roughly sewn rub-ons. Yeah, so they have, and I got this uh, months and months and months ago when the when they released their new paper lines, I had purchased um, this stamp set, um, Crazy Stitching. And it has stitches and hearts that look like stitches and, and all that. So these are stamps. This is the acrylic stamps. So I guess this is the, these are the rub-ons that come uh, with that uh, paper line. And um, so uh, these are rub-ons in white and black. And I have had very little experience with rub-ons uh, and very uh, limited uh, purchase of rub-ons. So these are great. Um, I can't wait to actually have these. And it's, it's cool that these are actually stitches. Um, and sewing. I love that. Yes, definitely. Um, hold on one second, guys. Sorry, I'm back. Okay, so um, copper crackle paste. Oh, so here's another um, art extravaganza uh, by Finn and Bear. I have their uh, opal color. So this is the copper, very pretty copper color. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. um, and I love uh, copper and bronze colors, so this is absolutely awesome. So we'll definitely have to use that in a video. Oh, look at the beautiful flowers. Garden seeds, linen. So, yeah, 49 the Market has pretty, pretty flowers. Oh, my goodness. Awesome. And then let's see another stamp set in this kit. Oh, we got a couple. We got a moth and a butterfly. What looks like a bee. Um, got a couple uh, posted stamps. It looks like. Remember the moments and a tree. I, I really like that. The, the tree is awesome. OMG. Yes, Paris. Yes, I love the stamp set. Another one to add to my stash. Yay! Ooh, chipboard. Time. Memory. Oh, Dusty Attic. Mm-hmm. I didn't know the Dusty Attic uh, or the, 40, uh, the Dusty Attic designed for 49 Market. That is awesome to know. See? 
Oh, did I show, did you guys see the stamp set too? <laughs> I forget that I'm filming. <laughs> so that's cool. Oh, I'm going to have to give this away now that I have another set. Oh, I didn't know this came with the set. Well, be on the lookout on my channel. There'll be a giveaway at some point in the future. Yep, because this is the same one, I think. Yep, it's the same one I have. So this, yep, so brand new uh, stamp set. So that'll have to go in my uh, other pile that I have, okay? And so let's see, then we have the remnants, a mini paper collection. So 49 and Market, when they come out with paper packs uh, or, or collections, so they came out with like four collections. And then on top of that, they come out with these mini collections. And they don't mean mini as in the size, they mean Many as in they're extra little, uh, extra collections um, that come out, but they're full-size collections. So let's take a look at this. That's freaking awesome. Um, oh, and you hear my dog. That's Loki. Those of you that have been watching my channel. Look at it. We've got stamps and clocks and shh. You be quiet. No one's talking to you. And, oh my goodness, look at mods and buttons. And oh my god, this is so pretty. OMG. Wow, this box is so big. Sorry, guys. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. It's so pretty. These are um, like die cuts. That's, that's what these uh, pages are. Look at that. That is pretty. Oh my goodness. Another piece. Oh, wow. Look at that. Very vintage. Oh, I love the flowers. Wow. Look at these flowers. Oh, very pretty. Gorgeous. Gorgeous. Just gorgeous. Oh, hold on one second. I've got to get the charger for my phone. Okay, maybe now I won't have any more interruptions. I'm so sorry. Oh, look at this paper. Oh, my gosh. And I, I forget the gal's name that designs um, or, or, or does 49 in paper. Or 40, 49 paper. Does the paper for 49 in market. Um, wow. Well, does it have her name on it on here? But I know that... Marta from Remy Small Art always mentions her name, and I always forget, but they're out of New York. But look at that gorgeous paper, you guys. Oh, my goodness. Look at, oh, that's, I love the colors. we got a little bit of green there, like an all, hinting, like leaning towards like an olive green. Like it's, it's, it's not, like it's like a, a very, it's a khaki. It's like very khaki color, and then you got a little bit of like a, a, a pinky magenta and then like a, a, a like a midnight bluish color fade oh that's so pretty so so pretty so pretty oh my goodness so pretty so pretty and these collections when they make these papers and the flowers and everything and they do these they, they, they all coordinate together so like you could get one of these paper lines and they came out with four in their last release. This is an, a sec, uh, an extra one. Uh, but they if you get the the entire collection in, 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 in each one, like each one of the four, like the flowers match, the papers match, the, you know, everything like coordinates. So like if you're a card maker and, you know, or you want to get into card making, it's very easy because everything like coordinates together. Oh, that looks like, this looks like tapestry. Or uh, like uh, like uh, you know you know stuff you'd use you know to make curtains out of they're very, very much like fabric. Oh my goodness, this is so pretty. Oh, so so pretty. Look at that. Isn't that just gorgeous? Oh, hold on, guys, one second. Okay, that was a phone call. <laughs> this video oh my goodness oh my gosh this paper is absolutely gobsmacking gorgeous this has they took what looks like newspaper overlaid it with some paint overlaid it with 
some um, spackle or, or intertwined um, spackle or, or like uh, concrete or, or wall of some sort. And then they have this, uh, definitely this, this is lace overlaid here. Oh my goodness, it is absolutely gorgeous. Or this might be, uh, they may have took, uh, taken um, like, uh, uh, not not cardboard, but um, uh, you know, corrugated board, and then like tore off the the one paper side, so you get that um, rough paper side of the corrugated board. I don't know; it's something very very much like that. Could even be um, this is lace, but it could even be like like on a dress or something. Oh, it's so gorgeous. So, so gorgeous. Here. Oh, I love this paper. Oh, my God. J Janine. That's who the gal's name is. Janine is the is the gal that um, that uh, owns or designs for, uh, I think she's the owner of 49 Market. I could be wrong. Uh, but, uh, yeah, her name is Janine. I remember now. Um Oh my God! This this paper collection is absolutely gorgeous, just absolutely gorgeous. So if you guys have a chance, um, I I know you can purchase. Um, ooh, forty nine a market doesn't sell to individuals, um, from my understanding. But what you can do is you can go to scrapbook.com and um, order from there. Um, to, uh, to get their their products, um, or you if you have a your favorite scrapbook store or or that. Um, now I'm not gonna be able to get the spec in there, and I'm not gonna waste the time on video. I'll deal with that later after I sign off. Um, have your favorite scrapbook store or 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 that check in and see if they can um, order the 49 Market product because because 49 Market will sell to businesses. Um, you know, got a few extra napkins thrown in there. Thank you, Z. <laughs> See, she always surprises you with surprises you with little extras. I love it. Oh. oh, she gave me some some little bits and bobs. Thank you, Z. These are mulberry papers. I got some little bits and bobs. Look at that. Oh, I will definitely use these. Um, look at all this fun stuff. Oh, yes. We will find a place for all of them. Look at this one. That's pretty pear paper. Look at that. Oh, I just love, like, mulberry paper, rice paper, Tissue paper, napkins. Oh, like I'm not going to go through all of this, but oh, that's very textured. Oh my goodness! Oh, beautiful, beautiful, wonderful stuff. Look at that. Oh my goodness! Thank you, V. This is awesome. You rock, honey. Thank you so much. Oh, she sent me scraps. I love scraps. <laughs> I will take scraps any day. Okay, on to my order. Okay, so I got the molds. Um, this, um, from what I understand is I should be able to take this mold and um, it, I think I can put this stuff in the mold. If I'm that. Uh, no, this is the crackle paste, but uh, but I might be able to. Uh, I don't have. I don't know. I have to talk with Z, but I maybe I ordered some of that stuff. No, maybe not. I, I know we were talking about this, and. Um, after we, I know you're, you're, you can put paste in here, so, uh, uh, what does it say? 
I know there's a, a, a stamp. This is by Stamperia. Um, so Z, if you're watching this, uh, hit. Uh, I'll I'll talk. I'll hit you up on 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 Messenger later. But um, you know, you could. I'm, obviously, you can use paper paper clay probably or or that. Um, but these are really soft molds, and and you can. There's a paste that Stamperia um, sells that you can put in here as well. And I don't know if I could use this stuff in there. But I'm wondering, I'm wondering if I can. Wondering if this is um, flexible enough. Vents um, permanent magnet. Yeah, I don't know. If not, I'll have to get some of that Stamperia paste. Um, because look at, aren't these, aren't they just pretty? Like, just imagine making some frames and then put these on a journal page or on a card or yeah I got I got I got to touch base with Z because I, I definitely wanted that and I, yeah um uh, I thought I had this one but I wasn't sure and I think this might be yeah this is definitely a duplicate of one I already have so I might put this um, as part of a giveaway, but this is the Janine's, not this one, I don't have that one, but Janine's Mindful by Studio Light is some new products that started coming out, um, oh, I want to say maybe two years ago now, um, maybe a year or so ago now, but, um, there's, th this gal uh, designs for them, and, um, has been coming out with different collections for Studio Light for, for at least a year, if not a little bit longer. Um, and there's all kinds of different collections. And I know Zeke uh, gets the collections um, here and there, um, or, or at least uh, uh, every time there's a new collection, she gets them. I don't know how much more she has in her shop. Um, but I do know that um, when she does get Studio Light products, um, she can probably only get so many. So if you're interested in the Janine's Mindful, and these are die cut books, and I'll show you what's on the uh, the, the back side. Kind of gives you a oh, I love this one. Oh, I can't start wait. To, but see, you, you get all those die cuts in this book, and you get uh, usually yeah, it's two of each. Look at all those little florals and butterflies, and oh, it's so pretty, so pretty, so so pretty. So, so pretty. Um, but, yeah, these are die cuts. They're not sticky, um, you know, but they're paper die cuts that, you you know, you can just, they uh, punch right out of the, the, the paper. So you can see that they're just punched right out. Um, and they're easy to use. They're fun to use. Um, but I think I have this one. I have to check. Um, but there's all kinds of different collections that this this gal, Janine, has uh, designed. Uh and she's not, I don't think she's the same Janine that's with 49 Market. <laughs> Definitely different people. Um, but yeah. So, uh, and here's another one. Um, and I don't think the same gal. This, oh, I think this was a different um, designer that designs that designed this one. Um, this one might be a duplicate too. I don't know. Maybe not. I can't remember. But I have to look. Um, it's got some fun stuff. I, I, I would know why. I, I, I could see why I would have ordered it twice. Um, but I don't, I don't see the, the designer on this one. Die cut, studio light. Uh. Oh, no, this is a different designer. This one is, um, designer by the name of Lou. But it doesn't have her last name on here. It just says Lou. And they put her 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 face in a locket. And they talk about her here on the back of the book. Um, each one has a little bit of a, a synopsis of who they are. Um, but yeah, these are fun to work uh, work with. But I, I, if you want to get um, some of this um, uh, Studio Light art collection books, get on uh, the site right away because she does run out of those fast. Okay, so, and then I ordered some more chipboards uh, to add to my collection. These are from Stamperia. Very pretty. 
ones I don't have, because the only ones I have right now are the ones I ordered from um, Scribenians. Beautiful butterflies and florals and swirlies. This one is, um, uh, you know, stars and, and that. Very pretty. This one is, is sea themed. Little plants. Very cute. I love it. I love it. Okay. And you guys know I'm a fanatic. OMG. That's too funny. Wait until I show you guys. Um, I <laughs> was at an auction uh, for napkins. And I got some napkins coming. And... I swear that the napkins I got coming have this gal's face, this this gal's face and hair on the napkins. Not all the rest of this could be, but at least this gal's face. And neck. So that is that is a small world. <laughs> uh, yeah, I know it's the same image. It has to be. That's that's too funny. Um, but anyway, this is rice paper. Lovely, lovely rice paper. Stamperio. Oh, yes. Isn't that pretty? Pretty, pretty. Yeah. Oh, that one's pretty, too. This one. Oh, love it. I know somebody who's going to love this one. And I think her name is Giggs. Very retro, very, um, oh, this one's pretty. Oh, wow. This Joanna Rivers must be a new designer they got on the team over there at Stamperia. This is the first time I'm seeing her name. Another fairy, very pretty. Winter fairy, right? Is the other one was a winter fairy? But yeah, fairy on a horse. And that one's just the fairy. Oh, very pretty. Winter. I love this winter stuff. Very pretty. Very, very pretty. Winter princess. Oh, wow. Mm-hmm. Oh, the penguins. Lucky. That is awesome. Oh. I'm already getting visions of where I'm going to see this stuff used. Oh. We are going to have so much fun on this channel. Polly bears. Oh, I've seen this girl's face. Not necessarily with all this. I, or at least I don't, I mean, I don't know if it's been the same with all of this on her hair. Um, but this whole image of her is pretty. I like that. Florals. Can't go wrong with vintage florals. Very pretty. Okay. Ooh, clock. Mm -hmm. Mm hmm. Oh wait. No. Wait. No, I had it right. Make sure I have it up. Of course, the sticker should tell you I had it right side up. That's gonna be pretty. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Okay. Some more rice paper here. Let's see. These are the big rice papers. Got whales. And sea life. Oh, look at this one. Very vintage girl. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Oh, loving these. Mm-hmm. Loving those. Oh, I have a small one of her, I think. Oh, this is beautiful. Oh, we're going to have to do some big paintings, y'all. Going to have to do some big paintings. See them now. Mm-hmm. I can see them. Oh, this one. Oh, look at that. That's very nice. Thank you, Z. Yeah, very nice rice paper. The girl knows me. He knows me too well. Oh, oh, we may have to do a Chris. Oh, we may have to do a Christmas painting. 
Oh, wow. We may have to do a, or, maybe not a Christmas, but maybe like a winter, winter. Look, we've got several pieces of winter here. Yeah, we may have to do a, win, a winter painting uh, before uh, winter is over, which, we, you know, can go past Christmas, right? Because, you know, but uh, people would be more apt to buy between now and Christmas. Very pretty. Lots of pretty flowers. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Okay, so and I did buy a um, couple of different more packs of the Stamperia paper lines. I love their paper. And um, it's great for card making too and scrap. Uh, it, it is more, I think, geared towards scrapbook, scrapbooking, but I like it for cards too. So this is, let me take this out of here and get this box out of the way. Over there. Okay. So this is the Shabby Rose collection. I could not pass it up. I had her order this one for me. That's another thing too. If it, especially with like Stamparia and Prima. Um, but I'm sure with a lot of other brands, if you see something that you really want, um, Z can probably get it for you. She has um, a connection, if you will, um, with the different um, uh, companies, right? She's been in the business for a while. She's been to um, the, 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 what is that yearly thing um, that, that, that the uh, people go to oh, out, out in Arizona or, or whatever. Uh, every year, so she she has connections. She's been in business a while. She she's she's had these. She's made relationships, so she has she has ways so she can order stuff from you because she's ordered stuff that um, she didn't have on her site for like Prima. I I wanted some Prima stuff. She's ordered from me. Um, Stamparia. She didn't have this one in her store. She ordered it for me because she has that relationship with these companies. So um, if you see something. Um, yeah, she can order it for you. So, you know, do, give Z the business. She, and she will, she will, um, she's great to work with and, um, she definitely deserves to, uh, get your business uh, uh, straight up. Um, so yeah, very beautiful shabby rose paper. Oh my goodness. Oh, wow. See, look at this A card background paper. Just, I mean, imagine it little bits of it oh omg even uh, this little bits of it oh pretty pretty and it's not super thick i mean it's it's thick but it's oh look at that oh my goodness now see this could be fussy cut and put on a card or i could vision that on a journal page but like look at definitely card worthy definitely card worthy same with this side um they are double-sided Oh, look, see, they, and then the, they, you always get pages like this that have different elements on it. Definitely can use this for cards. Oh, my goodness, so pretty, so pretty. I seen this, and I said, oh, I got to have that. Got to have that. Look, definitely, you can layer up your cards with this. You know, again, it's meant for scrapbooking, but, you know, and here, card background. Oh, look at, look, look at these colors. Yeah. Pinks and greens and oh, card backgrounds. Oh, I can see it now. I can see it now. Even this, but I, I think I would. I would think I would rather use this more so than this. You know, look here's some you know card pieces. You know, cut each one of them out. Mm -hmm. These look cute on cards too. I've used some of the round uh, pieces too. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yep. Pretty, pretty. Love this, love this. So you don't get very many, um, like with 49 Market, you get a really nice, good mix of papers that you can, some that are great for fussy cutting elements out of, and then some are really great for backgrounds. And this one, where you get a couple pages that have some elements on there, but for the most part, 
I use these um, for background papers because there, there's not a lot here you could really fussy cut. And then you get another page, uh, but it's, and it's on the back, so it doesn't matter. So you use this side. Um, but yeah, their papers really got their papers are really nice for backgrounds on on cards or scrapbooking, because that's what their that's what their their claim is for you know scrapbooking. But I use it for uh, card making. So yeah. I love this. Okay, I'm not going to mess with that. That's going to go over there, and I'll mess with that uh, off camera. And then the princess one. This one I don't have. Oh, see, there's that same girl again with the, with the, with the stuff in her hair. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. Okay. Ah. Okay, don't don't stick. Yeah, that's why I don't care if you rip, but they're they're sticky on their uh, um, paper. It's just it's sticky. You see, just doesn't want to even come apart. Anyway, okay. So this is very Victorian. Um, very 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 lovely. Oh. See, and then here, this set has some stuff, which, you know, believe you could put that on a card, you know. So, I mean, they've got some stuff, but this would be like, you know, you could use this for a little girl's, if you're doing a, uh, a scrapbook page for a little girl's room or something like that. Doors. Oh, I like that. I don't know about these ladies yet, but they'll come in handy for something. Then you've got these little things you can cut out it's on the other side. Actually, very pretty. Hmm. I definitely use the doors on cards, though. That would be pretty. You definitely have to use those on cards. And then we have um, the uh, Stamperia. Is very. Uh, I've noticed that they have a lot of um, uh, mannequins in their their work. See, there's that girl. With, I'm telling you, I recognize that. Um, but even like this, if you didn't want anything on this side, you know, you could cut off, you know, a little piece of this, you know, and make that a card piece, right? You know, so, yeah, I like the frame here. Not really care for the picture too much, but you definitely use the frame. Oh, pens and ink. Very cool. I really like that. Love the paper here. Oh my goodness. Love. Another door. Yeah, definitely use this side. <clears throat> yep. Oh, look at this. Look at the envelopes with the seals on it. Those are cute. Oh, and gee, yeah, those would have to get used. Yep. Even this is pretty. Yep, I think I would have to forego. This is really pretty too. Mm -hmm. I think I'd have to. I would have to forego this side, and I would. I would. I could see myself using this. This stuff on Ella on cards. Look at the fans. I was hoping they would be nice and big. Look at. But you cut that out and you put that on a card. Oh my goodness! Is a is like a more of a forefront piece, not more. Of a, you know, less of a background piece. Oh, with some flowers and some die. Oh, that's so pretty. So pretty. And look, you have um, some music and a piano. Oh, but I, I would have to keep my fans. Yep. I wouldn't get very much out of the pianos because I'd have to use my fans. Look, and then you got some little elements here you can cut, cut around or fussy cut. But, oh yeah, I could forego this side and keep this side. See, that's the kind of choice. You know, unless you bought two packs. Look at the bodices. Or bodice, yeah, bodice, uh, what do you call it, yeah, cute, 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 this one has a lot more elements, look at, lots of little elements, umbrella, so, yeah, I mean, they're paper packs, again, get more geared towards scrapbooking, although this one does have a lot more elements in it, too, to cut out, so, that looks like it, that was everything in my butterfly paper, <laughs> I'm going to have to fussy cut each and one, every one of these butterflies out.
Thank you, Z. Love you. That is it, guys. I think I went through everything. All my rice paper. All my freebies. Thank you, Z. I love you. My chipboard, my rice papers, my jeans, uh, my scrapbook papers, um, chipboards, uh, my 49 market collection, uh, flowers, and uh, rub-ons, and stamps. And yeah, that, that's, that's everything. <laughs> oh, paste. <laughs> uh, yeah, a little bit of everything, guys. So um, that was my haul. Um, yeah, check out Paint and Paper Studio. Uh, Z is awesome to work with. Her name is Zandra. She is the sweetest. Um, yeah, give her your business, guys. Give her some love. I love you, Z, and I'll be shopping again. Talk to you soon. Love you all. Bye. Take care. Have a great weekend.